Finance Minister Mtulin Cube yesterday filed an appeal against a high court judgment on Wednesday, which banned the Zimbabwe Revenue Authority, Zimra, and Treasury from charging 14.5% value-added tax VAT, on all imported rice products. Taxing of rice imports had resulted in the prices of the product going up by 20% to 25% as importers passed on the costs to consumers. Human rights activist Bongai Zamudzi, through her lawyer Obey Shava, had dragged Ngub and Zimra to court for double taxation of rice imports. But in his ruling on Wednesday, High Court Judge Justice Webster Chinamhora said it should be exempt from taxation. Zimra and Cube had backdated the charging of VAT on imported rice to 2016. Yesterday, Cube deposed his application to challenge Justice Chinamhora's ruling through his lawyers, Cantor and Immerman. It being common cause, or must be taken to be common cause, that the ministry is not liable for assessment or payment of value-added taxes contemplated by Section 6 of the Value-Added Tax Act, he argued. Cube said the relief sought was in respect of alleged past rights, as opposed to existing or future rights. He said the court erred at law in finding that the ministry had established that it had locus standi to seek, let alone be granted, the relief as per the amended order. Cube also submitted that the appeal be upheld with costs and the judgment of the court be set aside in its entirety and be replaced with the dismissal of the matter with costs. Dot Shaba had argued that the charging of VAT on rice, which was exempted in terms of the law from tax, was illegal. The judgment further ordered Ngub and Zimra to pay costs of the suit.